In this video, you'll become familiar with the admin section and tools, how to integrate your Facebook page and like box, and link up your Google Analytics account. Now that you've created your community, let's go over some basics to get you up and running. We're focusing here on the admin section, where you'll find all the tools you need to configure your community. Here on your account details page, you'll find information about your plan level, past invoices, and billing details. This is also where you can update your billing contact info. Next, let's go over the community details page to set up some of your basic info. Upload your logo and customize its display. On qualifying plans, you can also upload an icon to use for customizing your champion's badge. In participation settings, you can manage the participation banner and create a custom message to your community. There you can use HTML to embed an image or a video. Helpful hint, your message should warmly welcome members and state the intention for the community. Be sure to use this opportunity to set a positive tone. Add support links to give your community members quick access to external resources like your company website, blog, Facebook, Twitter pages, and more. Helpful hint, enable your Facebook like box here and allow for your community to easily like your page. You can even create links to specific topics in your community based on a tag or product. On qualifying plans, you can integrate your existing Google Analytics account to track certain community metrics like visitor numbers and traffic sources. Certain plans also allow you to ban disruptive users. Just verify an email address to enable this feature. In the Employee and Roles page, you can add employees. Depending on your plan, you can set their status as an employee, official rep, or admin, and toggle on moderator status for any of the roles. Get Satisfaction for Facebook, available on qualifying plans, is simple to set up within your admin section. It allows you to integrate your Get Satisfaction community right inside your Facebook page. Helpful hint, just make sure you're also an admin for your Facebook page account. With these basics in mind, you'll get your community page up and running in no time flat.